Two young fashion designers from St. Kitts and Nevis departed the Federation this week to present their designs at the New York Fashion Week. Shafia Gishard and Micaiah Collins won a competition at the PDMA Fashion Show held in St. Kitts back in October 2018. And as part of their prize, won the chance to showcase their designs at the grand event on September 8th. On Sunday and Monday at the RLB International Airport before their departures, both Shafia and Mikaia spoke about how they felt to have won this golden opportunity. Well, I'm excited, nervous a little bit, but mostly excited for the opportunity. I feel excited. Each spoke about pursuing their passion for fashion designing at a young age. I started when I was about six years old until I made my first dress when I was eight years old. And from then, I keep on blooming. I started out designing stuff, sketching the designs, sketching what I want, how I want it to be. And then I went into the process of picking the colors, fabric, making sure everything cohesive, blends well, mesh well, everything is good. And then the sewing process started. Okay, so now I'm here. And who are their inspirations? Um, Alexander McQueen and David Mugler. They're my top two. I love them. Um, the design aesthetic, creativity, architects. I look up to Karen Matthew, Jasmine. I look up to people like Sherry Hale and Moschino, big designers. Both Shafia and Mikaia are hoping to accomplish big things from participating at the New York Fashion Week. My next move will be to continue blooming and to improve more my skills to the point where I can open a store and sell my designs. I'm well, looking forward to the most, probably networking, looking forward to meeting new designers, seeing everybody else's designs. I mean, it's New York Fashion Week, why not? <laughs> Both young ladies are accompanied by an adult, in the case of Mikaia, her mother Isis Walters, and Shafia's aunt Janet Gishard. Mikaia was recognized for her work as one of the 25 most remarkable teens in 2018. I'm Andre Huey for SKN Newsline.